turtles are part of the reptile family, and some turtles can live over 80 years. Turtles are cold-blooded, which means they need the sun to warm their bodies. A group of turtles is called a bale. The largest species of sea turtle is the leatherback. They can be between four and nine feet long and can weigh over 2,000 pounds. Some turtles can breathe water through their rear ends. That lets them stay underwater to avoid their enemies. Pretty cool, huh? The sun is actually a star. It is the largest object in our solar system and makes up 99.8% of the total mass. The sun is 4.6 billion years old. One million Earths could fit inside the sun. The sun's core temperature is about 27 million degrees Fahrenheit. Wow, that's hot! The sun is 93 million miles away from the Earth. Because it's so far, it takes eight minutes for the sun's light to reach the Earth. Pretty cool, huh? Mammoth was an ancient relative to modern elephants. It was covered with coarse hair and had tusks that were up to 16 feet long. Woolly mammoth fossils have been found across Europe, Asia, and North America. Mammoth drawings made by ancient humans in caves were some of the world's earliest art pieces. When the pyramids of Egypt were being built 4,000 years ago, paintings of mammoths were created meaning there may still have been mammoths alive on Earth. In Russia, an 11-year-old boy found a 30,000-year-old mammoth that was preserved in the snow. It still had skin and hair that scientists were able to study. Pretty cool, huh? There are more than 3,500 species of mosquitoes, and around 176 of them are found in the United States. Mosquitoes have been around for about 100 million years, or even longer, meaning they've been around since the time dinosaurs were on Earth. Mosquitoes have cellular receptors on their heads that can detect carbon dioxide, so they can locate people by their breath. Female mosquitoes lay up to 300 eggs at a time. Mosquitoes can be pesky, but only female mosquitoes bite. Both genders mainly feed on fruits and plants, but females need protein and blood to help them lay their eggs. Pretty cool, huh? From the base of its pedestal to the top of its torch, the Statue of Liberty is 305 feet tall. There are 354 steps inside the Statue of Liberty that you can climb to reach the head. The Statue of Liberty was built in France, disassembled, and then rebuilt in the United States. The Statue of Liberty is made of copper, just like pennies. When it was first built, it was the same color as a penny, until the chemical process of oxidation turned it completely green almost 100 years ago. Pretty cool, huh? Sharks swim through the ocean like airplanes. They use their tails instead of propellers to generate thrust, and they use their side fins like wings. There are 500 types of sharks that we know of. The great white shark is the famous predator, but many sharks are not dangerous. There are three types of sharks that only eat plankton. The whale shark, the megamouth shark, and the basking shark. Sharks don't sleep the same way people do. Scientists believe the dogfish shark sleeps while it's swimming. Horn shark eggs are shaped like corkscrews. Pretty cool, huh? Some lemurs are nocturnal, which means they're mainly awake during the night. Because of their limited vision, lemurs rely a lot on their sense of smell. When lemurs are low on food, they will sometimes slow down their metabolism. In some species of lemurs, their tails are longer than their bodies. Lemurs have stink bites to control their territory, 
the stinkiest lemur wins. Pretty cool, huh? Pluto is now considered a dwarf planet. It is about 4.6 billion miles from the sun at the furthest point in its orbit. Since Pluto was discovered in 1930 by astronomer Clyde W. Tombaugh, it has yet to complete a full orbit around the sun. A single orbit around the sun takes about 248 Earth years. Just recently, NASA's New Horizon probe made history by successfully flying to Pluto to collect data. This mission took nine years to reach the dwarf planet after it launched in 2006. Due to its distance from Earth, scientists know very little about Pluto. But they believe that the temperature on Pluto is about 400 degrees below zero. And it has a giant bright spot on it shaped like a heart. Pretty cool, huh? Hummingbirds are among the smallest of birds, measuring between two and five inches. Hummingbirds are the only species that can fly in all directions, including backwards and upside down. Some hummingbirds can flap their wings up to 80 times per second. They flap their wings so fast, it makes a humming sound, which is where they get their name. Hummingbirds are very smart. They can remember flowers they've been to and seem to know when the flower will refill its nectar. A hummingbird can weigh anywhere between 2 and 20 grams. That's less than a penny! But its brain is the biggest for its size of any known bird. Pretty cool, huh? Canada is the second largest country in the world, after Russia. Over half of the people living in Canada have a college degree, making it one of the world's most educated countries. Canada has the longest coastline in the world, with 125,567 miles of coast. During cold winters, temperatures can drop to negative 20 degrees Celsius, meaning parts of the Atlantic Ocean on the Canadian coast can freeze enough that people can play hockey on it. Canada has an estimated 2 million lakes, which is more than any other country in the world. Pretty cool, huh? In any drink, talk, and breathe. Most tongues have anywhere from 2,000 to 10,000 taste buds, but they are not visible to the human eye. Every 10 to 14 days, a person's taste buds die off and are replaced. The ability to roll or curl your tongue is not entirely genetic, and it may be something you can learn. Just like fingerprints, everyone's tongue print is completely different. Pretty cool, huh? Tigers are well known for their orange, black, and white striped fur. In fact, each tiger's stripes are unique, like a fingerprint. The markings on a tiger's forehead have a close resemblance to the Chinese symbol for king, which has given them a cultural status as king of the jungle. The stripes help camouflage the tigers when they are hunting in the jungle or stalking in tall grass. Their stripes blend in with tree branches and shadows, making it hard for other animals to see them. But did you know that a tiger's skin is also striped? So, if a tiger lost all its fur, the tiger would still have its stripes. Pretty cool, huh?